Although wild badgers are very wary of humans, it's possible to watch them, or at least find signs of them, if you know what to look for. Badgers often make sets in woodland. The tunnels and chambers can cover a wide area with many entrance holes. Here's a badger footprint and a pile of old bedding straw. And here's a badger actually at work, digging out soil from a set entrance. The soil and bedding badgers dig out can make quite a pile over the years. Nearby trees may have scratch marks. On a frosty winter day, you can see if there's life below. Badgers keep to well-worn tracks, which other animals also use. As they travel about, they pause to leave a drop of scent here and there, marking out the group's territory. When another badger comes along, he recognises the scent. Badgers stick to their tracks so firmly that special gates have to be made to let them through rabbit fences. The gates are too heavy for rabbits to push open. Where roads have been built across their tracks, badgers may easily be killed by traffic unless a tunnel can be made to let them pass safely. There are lots of badger tracks near the wildlife centre. And do you know what some children found the other day where a track goes under a barbed wire fence? Some badger hair. Poor Jane's been a long time. Talking about badgers is fine for her, but I'm all alone. Help! Help! Oh! God, did you see that? Stripes, weren't they? Oh, I don't know. Time, fine, stripe. Cool, magic E's certainly working. Let's see what that magic E wizard is up to. You need me, I'm magic E. Magic, magic E. Magic, magic E. A strip gets a stripe with me, a pip. Makes a pipe with me, here. What you do with me, add magic, magic E. Magic, magic E. Words change around with me. When they are found with me, here. How they sound with me, I'm magic, magic E. Magic, magic E. A pin makes a pine with me, twin becomes twine with me, yeah! What you do with me, add magic, magic E, magic, magic E. Words change around with me, when they are found with me, hear how they sound with me, I'm magic, magic E, magic, magic E. The wizard's on his way again. Sing the missing words. Magic, magic E. Magic, magic E. A strip gets a with me. A pip makes a with me. Hear what you do with me. Add magic, magic E. Magic, magic E. A pin makes a with me. Twin becomes with me. Hear what you do with me, add magic, magic E, magic, magic E. Words change around with me when they are found with me. Hear how they sound with me, I'm magic, magic E, magic, magic E. Hello, Wordy. We haven't had much time for a chat today. No, and I want to ask you about the next bit of the story. Did Badger Girl and her friends find the ponies? Let's see, shall we? Nice. 
more bike tracks, though. Which way do you think we should go? Well, if this map is right, it ought to be this way. Up that slope, and then we should see a little wood on the other side. Well done. Nothing like a map for finding your way. I know what's what. Oh, no. What? Norman hasn't got a map, has he? He's going to get lost again. He'll be all right. Norman always gets there in the end. Come on, let's get up this hill. They ran as fast as they could to the top of the hill and then down the other side. At last, they'd reached the meeting place by the lake. We're too late. No Mick, no Barker, no Deal. No big van. No nothing. Wait a minute. Look down there. It's the ponies. Mick must have brought them here. Barker can do haven't arrived with a big van yet. What should we do? We haven't got time to get the police. It's Marston near this village. Oh, we've got to do something. Let's creep down and get them away before Barker and Deal get here. Yeah, great. Steady. Talk to them the way Mick does. All right, my handsomes. I know the nasty men brought you here. We'll soon get you away. Well, I hope so. Well, well, well. Grab him, Mr. Deal. What do you think you're doing, eh? Nothing. We weren't doing any harm. That's right. We were, we were just out for a walk. And we saw the ponies and we thought we'd have a go at riding one of them. Well, I never. Just thought you'd have a go at riding our ponies, eh? They're not your ponies anyway. Oh? What do you think of that, Mr. Deal? I think we've seen these kids about once too often, Mr. Barker. I think they're up to no good. You show this up to no good? Your pony rustlers. What a dreadful thing to say. We can't let them go now, Mr. Barker. No, indeed, we can't. I think I know just the place for them. Into the van with them, Mr. Deal. There was nothing the children could do. Barker and Deal pushed them into the van and shut the doors. Nice and safe on the other side of the lake. You won't get away with it, you know. The badger man knows all about you and the police. What a pity they weren't here to help you then. Well, I'm afraid you're telling fibs again. What do you say, Mr. Deal? I oh, say kids are a real pain. <laughs> but someone else was already near the hut. Someone with a stripe down his head. Stripey ran off and hid. Out of the van. But he was still there and saw everything. Get out of your tongue! Oh, still! Inside! Get up! Excellent. By the time they get out of there, we'll be on our way to France. If they ever do get out. <laughs> oh, Mr. Deal, what an awful thought. 